colonizer hey hey guys welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new my name is Lo, and today we are going to livingston so i'm just waiting for my friends to come and pick me up and we'll be on our way do you like my hoodie it's a dora hoodie from eerie threads so yeah let's go This guy. These lights are so pretty. My hometown. View, but I'm so tired. I can't wait to just bath and sleep. There was like a mix up with my room. They gave me some, well, they didn't give me someone's room. The porter I read the wrong room, and I can't see. I'm sure I've mentioned I had eye surgery, so I can't like read very well. So, and like the print was like really small. So, he read the wrong room number and he took me to a room and we opened literally someone else's room. I was like, that's that's impossible. <laughs> it's impossible. So yeah, so this is my room and I'm gonna make tea, listen to an audiobook and get ready for bed. I'm like really tired. Um got here around twenty one thirty ish. Let me just check the time. Yeah, twenty one thirty. So yeah, I'm really tired. But I'm happy to be here. I don't know why I have two beds, but here we are. I'm not sharing. I'm gonna try and ask them to change it tomorrow, but I feel like this is how this room comes. Like, yeah. TV. I better keep these windows closed because i'm not trying to have monkeys in my room bathroom toilet mirror shower i can't wait to just shower and sleep because it's breakfast day one don't judge me for the bacon like there's so much bacon on my plate I, it was so service and I literally just accidentally got too much bacon and I couldn't put it back because the woman was staring at me. Oh, Radisson, the new Radisson Hotel. Say hi, girl. Hi. <laughs> it's really pretty here. This is not where I'm staying, unfortunately. But it's really pretty. But the rooms are small. <laughs> no shade. Refreshment station. Say hi, Kandu. Hi. <laughs> Trying to run away from me. <laughs> A little bit how pretty your view is i don't have a view i just have grass and you have monkeys eh? and police officers sitting by my <laughs> by my window <laughs> it's so creepy let me see yeah the room look at how look at how tiny the bed no. is <laughs> i'm putting this in the vlog like seriously like do you see this this phone this is the phone to the bed size come on like how much is the room per night? Three hundred and sixty-four thousand. Three thousand five hundred. Not me. Three thousand six hundred and forty kwacha. Yeah, this bed. <laughs> you can't even pass in the, the middle. Small. That's what they <laughs> One leg at a time. time. But it's so pretty. It's just too small. This room is, is but like the same size as there the is. The you know why? Mm. If you move this room, because the best is abandoned. So. They are on the wall. Mm -hmm. So and the TV is okay. Yeah. They can put it down. They can, uh, if they remove, then yes, they remove each. That's this. 
but I like the doors, like the finishing is so cute. Let me turn on the. Emma, how do you turn on the light in this place? Oh, it's there. What is that sound? Oh my god. This is like a nice one bed. What a really pretty. They even put your toilet bags for you. Yeah. The shower is cute. It's brand new, guys. It's not bad at all. The water I live in is brown, guys. It's totally It's pretty. This is for me. Oh, this is for me. And this is for Inkandu with the mixers he's such a whore that's the problem i can't say the name because we're literally vlogging <laughs> say hi babe hi babes how are you i'm good hi. guys let me show you the menu <laughs> ignore my hairy arms the prices are literally sending me into a coma like, why is everything so fucking expensive? But anyways, it is what it is. Let's look at the prices of water. 500 mils is 40 kwacha. 750, 55. Like, y'all. It's just water. They could literally give us water from the top. They're okay. It's like they were frozen. Chips that you fry, like you cut the potatoes and you fry them like straight. Yeah. Look at that gooiness. Oh, yeah. This is my outfit. I didn't film much of yesterday. I'm sorry, guys. The day was a little bit dramatic. But today, hopefully, we can go to the falls. I love this dress. I got it from Dab, guys. It's so cute. It has pockets. It's just so adorable. Making a cute. Yeah, so yeah, we're hopefully going to go to the falls and just do some hopefully fun stuff. I don't know. All I know is I'm gonna drink the way I drank yesterday, I'm gonna drink again today, so yeah. This is what I got today. I was so fucking late. Breakfast has already ended, so Luckily, they allow me to get some food Actually, in the face of the sun. I don't even know because it's so bright. Lady leaving After the clips from the boat, I was gone. I was out of commission. So yeah, she's out of pretty day. She's still kissing on my dress. Yes, I have black clothes. I don't wear color, guys. I don't wear color. But like, yeah, this is what we're doing today. Today we are going to literally try and do the stuff we we're supposed to do yesterday. So yeah. Wish us luck. We're going to hopefully go to the falls today and um, see like the we did not in fact see any animals because the living stand for some reason is so expensive for doing anything. A simple game drive was 650 kwacha per person. Like, I get it, people have coin, you're going on holiday, but like can we be realistic guys? It was so irritating to me. Lions, but yeah, we'll see how that goes so let me go try and catch breakfast but today i'm not drinking because i don't want to be sick i've drunk two days straight like a psycho so yeah going for breakfast that i'm always disappointed by Let's do it. Let's do it. 
I'm actually dreading eating this breakfast because I feel so hungover and so sick and disgusting. But I know that I need to eat. Meow. I did it to myself. Yep. I think so. I don't know. I haven't been here in years. Go this way to. What's the very important thing? You got the food. Do it. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Me, I want to go to the food. Okay, but, but there's the. Food there. To go the no, Look okay. okay. at how fucking dangerous this actually is. This is insane. No, the best one is that side. You see the more falls when you go that side. Yeah. But let's go there. Look at all the, like, the mist. I don't know if you can see. But like it's so fucking insane. Like, Zambia is so beautiful. Me on a picture where we can see clearer. It's a photo shoot. Tell us what we're looking at. Woo, look how beautiful. Oh, it's so pretty, and there's like a bench you can sit there. Woo! Look at the falls, they're so pretty. Uh -huh. Hi, hi. Hey, wow. wow. But I also want to see ya. Huh? I want to see ya. <laughs> okay. soaking soaking wet but it was great you know yeah so I couldn't get much footage because obviously everything 
it's just covered in water so it was insane i couldn't even hold my phone and i already can't see because i my eyes are insane but i could see the falls because they're big enough to perceive and we're heading back to lusaka today hopefully we can sort of relatively early so that we don't get home late because as adults we have work tomorrow so yeah it's been a fun trip and living so is always fun expensive but fun yeah so i was editing the living some vlog and i realized i didn't end the vlog in any way shape or form kind of just ends abruptly with me complaining about a muffin i think yeah so i just wanted to say we got back safely as is evidenced by my presence and yeah um kubu cafe man like i thought it was supposed to be one of those really really good cafes but their baked goods were not very good to be honest and that muffin I, I was so disappointed in it but it wasn't expensive it was like 35 kwacha but yeah it was really bad and I also got a slice of cake I just didn't post it because I really really didn't like that cake it was way too sweet and flat it's like they didn't put any salt in the cake so it was just flat you know salt elevates it elevates sweet things so yeah it was yeah it left very much like a lot to be desired but yeah we arrived safely i got home around i want to say yeah like around 18 hours yeah somewhere there you know me and the girlies we always start off late no matter how early we wake up we always start off late so yeah and i just want to vent like how ridiculously expensive Livingston is like I know maybe I'm just frugal or I'm just broke but I feel like there should be so many more affordable things for locals to do uh, I don't understand why we are charging 650 kwacha per person to go on a game drive back in my day when I was in like high school I remember we didn't pay that much and you could just go with your with your car and it's not that big of a deal but I don't know I don't know what it is everything is so expensive and the food guys tell me in Livingston where there is good food like the Indian restaurant was was okay it was like a six out of ten but their naan is not that chewy you know glutinous naan it's 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 just it gives pita bread but their curries are tasty but like what <sighs> the hotels are not giving they give nothing and i don't know I, okay i had fish at zest i really liked zest i remember once not not this trip another trip i had fish at zest and that fish was really really good but are you telling me if you're not eating fresh fish you're not going to enjoy your food radisson's food mediocre avani's food zero out of ten like they have a restaurant and like the hotel food both are bad i remember the last time i was there before this trip avani i had a burger at avani the the bun was cold the bun was cold and it felt like stale guys i was so disappointed and even the breakfast has just i don't know what's going on what's going on and i feel like it's kind of embarrassing because people travel the world and you're telling me this is like a three-star restaurant like uh, not restaurant hotel or whatever and your food is mediocre radisson brand new they are making my friends pay over three thousand for a single bit and they give me a burger and fries the the burger itself was rather bland there was barely any sauce on the burger even though i said the juiciness that was just smoke and mirrors the burger itself had no sauce no salt nothing the chips had no seasoning it's like the chefs in there were like shocked that we didn't want to pay 500 kwacha for the buffet 500 kwacha for the buffet and the food didn't even look sexy i don't know what's going on in livingston but i feel like we need to have better restaurants at the very least 
you know if you're gonna make your activities expensive like your bungee jumping is 100 and what 150 dollars i don't know your helicopter ride is 300 dollars that's fine but can we have places where we can eat please 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 and thank you yeah so yeah living so was fun though i had fun with my friends i had so much fun at the falls i was completely drenched because we where i cut off obviously i couldn't film us walking like most of the way across the falls it's obviously it goes into zimbabwe so we didn't go all the way but there's this walk that you do and it was so insane i could barely i can barely see already but like the water was just so intense soaked to the bone but it was so worth it it felt so nice such a nice hike that's the only hike i can do i don't like doing exercise i hate working out as you can see because i obviously have gained weight but that's also because of my surgery so leave me alone yeah but it was fun i always love seeing the musatunia yeah anyways thank you for watching see you in the next one bye